We've got the MLB slate here. We got early baseball today. That's what I like. We got day baseball cricket. This is awesome. So we kick things off today with the Phillies at the Mets. The Phillies. Uh, oh, oh, my bad. I'm getting ahead of myself. Go ahead, sir. Oh, uh, Aaron Nola on the bump for the Phillies. Jose Buto will be going for New York. Uh, Phillies minus 130. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Aaron Nola's on the bump and the Phillies are only a minus 130 favorite. What are we doing here? What are we funny, doing huh? against, against the Mets? I think, mm. I think Buto's pitched pretty well early on. Let me double check that. But still, I'll, it's still, Nola still like red hot Phillies. Hmm. Sharp money and big money coming in on those Phillies. 80% of the bets, 89% of the money back in Philly at minus 130. Nationals. Uh, Nationals at the White Sox. This should be uh, game one of a doubleheader today, y'all. They got postponed yesterday, but you got uh, that matchup from yesterday. You got Trevor Williams on the bump for Washington, and Chris Flexen will be going for Chicago. Ooh, Flexen, okay. Uh, Washington minus 115 favorite. Sharp money coming in on the Nationals. Big money coming in on the White Sox, so with 24% of the bets, but 82% of the money backing Chris Flexen on them and the White Sox. Remember, Blue Jays and the Orioles. Real quick, Will. Remember, we're going to fade whoever wins the first game and the second game. That's what you do on those double headers. Whoever wins the first one, you take the other team in the in the next game. That's right. Blue right. Jays at the Orioles. Chris Bassett on the hill for Toronto, and Kyle Bradish will be going for Baltimore. Baltimore minus one fifty four home favorites. There, you got Blue Jays plus one forty on the comeback. Sharp money coming in on the Blue Jays. Big money coming in on the Orioles, though, with eighty seven percent of the bets and ninety six percent of the money back in the Orioles tonight. Marlins at the Tigers. Ryan Weathers on the hill for Miami, and Reese Olsen will be going for Detroit. Detroit minus 180 favorites. Okay, the Fish plus 163 on the comeback. 86% of the money is on Detroit to get it done at home today. Tampa Bay and the Red Sox. Aaron Savali on the hill for Tampa Bay, and Nick Pavetta will be going for Boston. Boston minus 118 home favorites after losing uh, game one yesterday to the Rays. Rays. Plus 108 on the comeback, sharp money on the Rays, big money on the Red Sox. So it was 78% of the bets, but 93% of the money. People are liking the Red Sox to bounce back today at home. Cubbies at the Braves. Jamison Talion will be going for Chicago, and Chris Sale is hit on the hill for the Bravos. Ah, that's why the Braves are minus 190 home favorites, but you got uh, sharp money coming in on the Cubs at plus 172, 94% of the bets, and 99% of the money back in the Braves at home today. Pirates at the Brewers. You got Quinn Priester on the hill for Pittsburgh, and Joe Ross will be going for Milwaukee. And you're right, Loki, the Orioles do go on the no-bet list, those assholes. <laughs> yes, that's absolutely <laughs> true. Uh, the uh, the Brewers, minus 148 favorites. Uh, sharp money coming in on those Pirates, though, at plus 135. 82% of the bets, 90% of the money so far. It's on the Brewers to get it done at home today. Yankees and the Twins. You got Chris, or excuse me, Carlos Roden will be on the hill for New York, and Chris Paddock will be going for Minnesota. Twinkies are plus 125 home dogs, and you got sharp money coming in on them, but big money coming in on the Yankees at minus 135. Road favorites, 73% of the bets, 90% of the money back in the Yankees at minus 135. Guardians at the Rangers. Guardians at the Rangers. Whoa, there it is. Okay, Ben Lively on the hill for Cleveland, and Jack Leiter will be going for Texas. Texas, minus 113 home favorite. Sharp money coming in on those Rangers, those Patriot 4165 Rangers. Maybe that will get them to come in here. I don't know. We'll see. 59% of the bets, 59% of the money is on the Rangers at minus 113 to get it done at home today. Nationals in the White Sox game two. Do we know who's pitching in game two? We do. We do. We got Mitchell Parker on the hill for Washington and Eric Fetty Wap. Just Fetty Wap? It's just Fetty, but we like to call him Fetty Wap. Okay. <laughs> Nationals 105 uh, road favorites in that one. Uh, even money on the White Sox. Big money so far coming in on the Nationals with 71% of the bets, 97% of the money uh, on the Nationals. CU says the Braves will win. I will be there. Dude, that sounds fun. Hey, that does sound like a good time. Eric Fetty is the only other, other Eric I've ever seen. My dad spells his name like Eric. E-R-I-C-K. I've always seen just the C or just the K. My dad's the only one I've ever seen with the C and the K. Well, Fetty Wap has a CK. Loki says Scheffler at plus 400 to win the PGA Championship. Is that the PGA Championship this weekend? Is that already happening? It might be. I'll have to look into that. Anyways, we're talking baseball right now. Um, see you. Root on Austin Riley for me. Okay. Whatever. Um, is, he, hey, is he back yet? Did he get hurt the other day? Oh, wait. Yeah, he got hurt. He's not, probably not playing. Yeah. Never mind. Never mind. You don't have to watch a disappointing performance by him. Um, the A's at the Astros. Oh, shit, y'all. It's J.P. Sears Day for the Oakland Athletics, baby. And then Ronald Blanco will be going for Houston. Okay. Houston minus 190 home favorites, 91% of the bets, 97% of the money back in the Astros at home today. 
Cardinals at the Angels. Sonny Gray on the hill for St. Louis, and Reed Detmers will be going for Los Angeles. Angels plus 125 home dog. Sharp money and big money coming in on the home dog here. 17% of the bets, 87% of the money so far back in the Angels at home. That is scary. That is scary back in, all, back in a team that that is just has no will to win a game. None. Good luck with that. Yeah. I'm going to put my money elsewhere. That's right. Royals at the Mariners. Can a uh, a fan catch a foul ball three times in a row tonight? We will find out. But who's pitching in this game, Cricket? We got Michael Watcha on the hill for Kansas City, and Logan Gilbert will be going for Seattle. Seattle minus 155, home favorite, sharp money back in the Mariners today at home. By the way, uh, Brady Singer is a bum, and I hate him. He's he's hey hey, hey. he's a no, there'll be no Brady he's Singer slander a, around here. Um, there'll he's be no pitching against the Mariners yesterday. He you realize those Mariners are pretty good, right? Yeah, do you realize they're the number one strikeout team in the league as far as like they the they strike out more than anyone else in the league? Somehow they're in first place in their division. Well, their pitchers also strike a lot of people out, so I don't care. They strike out. We're not talking about their pitchers. We're talking about their batters. They strike out more than anyone in the league. You got Brady Singer. All we need is eight strikeouts. Eight strikeouts, Cricket. This bum only gets six. That was my No, you, you never do that. Game. You never bet on the over on a game like that. That's just too easy. You got a team that strikes out the most against a pitcher that's really good. You never bet the over on his strikeouts right there. You know good and damn well he ain't getting over that. You that's absolutely too, do. Every single time. Oh, no. The only way that like doesn't cash is if the pitcher is an absolute bum, and that's what he is. He's Rockies not. at the Padres. No, be no Brady Singer slander. Kyle Quintrill on the hill for Colorado, and it's Dylan Cease day, y'all, for the Padres. Yes. Ooh, we get Dylan Cease at home. Oh, mm-hmm. Padres first five minus minus a million. Uh, Padres uh, minus two two seventy five home favorites. That is huge. Damn. We got a couple gyms of That's ninety four percent of the money is on the Padres money line today, and there's a good reason for it. Yeah, good, good, good. Reason. We got a couple good matchups today, bro. You know who? Uh, you know who? Who would strike out eight people? Dylan sees because he's he's not a bum. What? Reds at the Diamondbacks. Reds <laughs> at the Diamondbacks. Oh man, hey, it's that day, man. Can't bet on the Reds when Green's pitching. Hunter Green on the hill for Cincinnati, and Slade Sacconi will be going for Arizona. Ah, the only way that could be better is if it was uh, Zach Gallon, Green oh, on the red, oh, Zach Gallon at home. It would be like the biggest bet would, of the year. I would leave and go directly to the bank to get a loan out so I could bet it all on the Diamondbacks today. <laughs> <laughs> Sharp money and big money coming in on the Reds, though. That is dangerous. <laughs> I guess I guess not everyone knows about you don't bet on Green uh, when he's pitching for the Reds. You but, don't? Uh, all right. They're going to learn today. This Sharp one. money. Sharp money, big money coming in on the Reds. 28% of the bets, 94% of the money back in green in the Reds today. Good luck. Good luck. And then the final game tonight, Dodgers at the Giants. You got Gavin Stone going. This this is a weird game. They had uh, Yamamoto that threw last night, but they had Gavin Stone listed for most of the day, so I don't know what wound up happening there. But Gavin Stone will be on the hill for Los Angeles tonight, and Keaton Wynn will be going for San Francisco. Um, same, uh, the Giants plus 150 home dog sharp money coming in on the Dodgers at minus 165 big money back in the home dog though with 8% of the bets but 21% of the money on the Giants to get it done tonight and that's your MLB preview for today May was it May 15th is it May 15th uh, 14th already? 14th okay I'm getting quit, ahead of myself quit wishing our life away bro I know no, I, I'm just getting excited for the NFL release okay the schedule release I'm getting excited May 15th but May 14th I don't know there you go you excited there you have for that bro I don't know how you get excited for that we're still damn five months away from football I don't want to be thinking about who all is gonna be playing who six months from now well there's levels to this cricket and uh, <laughs> would you would you like to talk NFL schedule release or would you like to deep dive into the NBA playoffs I would like to deep dive into the NHL playoffs <laughs> what I'd like to 